we're going to talk about using Flatten in Cricut Design Space on your iPad. Flatten is used to change a cutting image to a print then cut image. The only time you ever want to use Flatten on an image is if you want to do a print then cut project. So I am going to hide this image and we're going to insert an image that has some layers on it. For example, this image. Right now, if I go into the layers panel, I can see Dad Rocks is my image. It has two layers. There's two lines here. The first layer is the teal outline of the um, words. And then the second layer is the gray kind of shadow outline. So you can also see they both say cut. If I was doing these as a cut file, I would then cut the teal either out of cardstock or vinyl, then cut the gray, and then layer those on top of each other. But if we wanted to do this for a print and cut, under Actions, we would click on Flatten, and now you can see in the layers, it said Flatten, but right next to the preview, it says Cut slash Print. So that means we're gonna first print this from our home printer, and then cut it on the Cricut. So let's see what that looks like. We'll hit make it in the lower right corner and you can see it's printing from our home printer this entire image in both the teal and the gray and then it's going to print this registration mark which is the dark black line around the entire image. Then after we print this we'll put this piece of paper on our Cricut mat, load it into our Cricut. It will then scan the image um, on the paper so that it knows where the registration marks are. And then it will just cut around that outer edge of the dark gray. This is a great way to make, um, if you're using sticker paper, to make stickers that have multiple colors in them. This would also be great to use to make planner stickers you can use this with a printable iron-on vinyl to do printable iron-on transfers for shirts. And um, it works really great. Use a inkjet printer and just make sure that you're, you have flattened your image so it cuts around the outside edge. Make sure to like my video and subscribe so that you can see all of my new videos coming out. Thanks.